This sucks. I know, winter is so boring. I know what we can do. <gasps> you are boring? Watching Winters River Moving! This winter, calling in sick isn't the only way to get off work. That's right, Stacy. There's a whole new way to go about it. Show him, Dingo. Hey, boss. Yeah, not gonna make it in today. Snow's good. So the ladies. I'm calling in stoked. What was that? I'm calling in stoked. Whatever, I'll talk to you later, Dingo. It helps to have a really cool accent. And a dumb boss. All winter, tune in to Fuel TV for workplace tips. Wer nicht schneit mit uns? Wir sagen ja was nach Fuel TV. It's the most fun you can have with your knickers on. I love it when ladies talk to me in different languages. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Yeah! How about a big Fuel TV welcome for our next guest, Mrs. Gertrude Smith. Oh, Ted, it's great to be here. So what is your question today? My son watches an awful lot of Fuel TV. What would happen if he stopped? Hmm, let's see. Let's spin the wheel and find out. Give her a spin. It's contortionist. That's right, Mrs. Smith. You better learn to love a contortionist, because if your son stops watching Fuel TV, he's going straight to the circus. So what will it be? I'll take Fuel TV! Looks like we have another winner, folks. Until next time! Fuel TV! I'm Dr. Franklin Rule, theoretical climatologist, to tell you about the dangers of paradoxical undressing. That's the weird phenomenon in which an individual, such as our subject here, begins to act in a bizarre fashion and start undressing in the bitter cold. That can lead to a pronounced loss of body heat and ultimately deadly hypothermia. Nice push. So please, please, if you're out in the cold, do not undress. Fuel TV cannot afford to lose even one of you out there. I'm Ninga Pak Chugiak. Uh, I'm not a real Eskimo, but uh, I play one on Fuel TV. You know, many people ask me, do you know like 24 words for snow? I know one, Fuel TV. That's two words. My bad.